If you look at almost all stress inoculation protocols, cold water, ice bath, cold shower, cyclic hyperventilation, those all do the same thing. They generate a lot of adrenaline release in the brain and a lot of adrenaline release in the body. But it's different if the adrenaline in the brain and body is evoked by you that you did it. Because under conditions under which you did the ice bath deliberately and now you're wide awake and really, really alert, there's this feeling that you have options. It wasn't done to you, but you can train up an ability to, for instance, think clearly and calmly. If you are familiar with the feeling of adrenaline in your brain and body, you navigate that in a, in a calmer way. How? Well, because adrenaline is generic. There's no adrenaline for the car crash, adrenaline for the height. It's all the same. So we can get better. We can raise our stress threshold. And that can be done through cold water, or cyclic hyperventilation. Cold water, you know, is a universal stimulus for creating adrenaline release.